What's up, travel friends? It's Stoof here from Travel Season. Welcome back to our channel. We've had a very busy past couple of months in Pittsburgh. We have both been busy with our jobs and we decided it was time for a nature day. So in this video, we are gonna talk about our nature day in Ohio Pile State Park. This is a special state park for us because it's only about an hour and a half from our home near Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. And this is also a special park because this is where we got engaged seven years ago. It has a handful of hiking trails, the Great Allegheny Passage biking trail runs through this park, the Yakagani River flows through this park, countless other streams and waterfalls flow through this park. There are some beautiful rock formations, lots of plants. It's a nice natural spot. And there also is a little town of Ohio Pile that has uh, some ice cream shops, sandwich shops, coffee shops, clothing shops, uh, raft rentals. You can go rafting on the Yakagani River. So there's a lot to do here. When we come to this park, we usually like to take it easy, do some moderate to easy hikes and maybe ride our bikes. On this day, we decided to do the Jonathan Run hiking trail, which is about four miles out and back type of trail. Uh, it features some waterfalls and streams, and this is a gorgeous trail for viewing the fall foliage. So we took Zedge with us and we just had a nice, easy hike through the forest, listening to the water and the crinkling of the leaves under our feet as we hiked. After the Jonathan Run hike, we headed down to the Cucumber Falls area, and that is the spot where Nate proposed to me in 2014. It's kind of a funny story there. It was a rainy day. There was a ton of water flowing over that waterfall in December of 2014. And because it was a rainy day, I was kind of leaning away from going on that hike that day. I was like, why don't we just not go and do that hike? Why don't we just stay inside today? And he was like, no, we have to do this hike today. And I was like, okay, I've never seen Nate so excited about a hike before. And then we get to the hike and we hike behind the waterfall and he has a little stone geode there <laughs> behind a rock uh, where he has an engagement ring inside the geode. After we visited that, we went over to the Yakagini River uh, Visitor Center area and we just had a nice little picnic lunch. I did some plein air painting. Nate did some writing on his tablet. Uh, every November he participates in NaNoWriMo, which is National Novel Writing Month, where you just have to write a novel every year. After lunch, we went up to the McCoon Trail, which is also about a four mile hike. And this hike is a little bit more strenuous, has a little bit more incline. And you do get some beautiful views of the foliage and you can get some views looking out into the valleys and the mountains and the distance. And that wrapped up our day at Ohio Pile State Park. As I mentioned, there are a ton of things to do in this park. I have a link to Ohio Pile State Park in the description under this video if you're planning on visiting. If you visit the Pittsburgh area, this is a great park to visit because it is only an hour and a half from Pittsburgh. This is also very close to Falling Water by Frank Lloyd Wright, if you're familiar with that awesome piece of architecture. That's very close to Ohio Pile State Park as well. So thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed our nice autumn nature day. Have a great day and happy travels.